Today we are talking with uh, Dr. Ephraim Goodman, who I consider a rather interesting person with a great life experience and meaningful thoughts. I know a lot, I know a lot about my father, but there is a private side of that in you know, my, my life. Would you please tell us something about your scientific career? Uh, you know, when you become older, some generalized uh, idea uh, seems uh, to be, uh, can be useful for other people. That is why I am here. Uh, and I want to talk about my career. In, uh, I would say I love animals from the very beginning uh, of my life. That is why uh, I become a biologist. My biological career, uh, scientific career, uh, fall apart on three levels. First, I uh, was a physiologist of nutrition. It, it was my uh, PhD thesis which I did under supervision of my great mentor, uh, Ugelev. Then I uh, did uh, next level of uh, Russian scientific uh, degree, uh, Doctor of Science. It was uh, devoted to uh, cooperation of uh, different systems in the cells and after that I worked for several years at the pharmaceutical laboratory. Uh, we developed a uh, very popular uh, now uh, drug uh, like phenazepam. It's something like Valium uh, in uh, Eastern, in Western uh, world, in Eastern uh, world, they use Venezuelan uh, uh, as uh, white as uh, uh, Valium here, and uh, I would say uh, it was very uh, helpful for me. Uh, a chaotic uh, manner of. Uh, uh, management of laboratory there because uh, some people can uh, uh, when they reach a certain level they can do whatever they want I want to satisfy my uh, curiosity and beside uh, experiments with uh, Phenazepam I did uh, experience with appetite uh, to find uh, how uh, nature regulate uh, food consumption. After that uh, I work uh, for a year for um, pharmaceutical company in US. It was Central Dogma and we used uh, an idea developed by my mentor was my participation uh, about universal functional units. Uh, this uh, concept, uh, this theory, dictated that uh, every cell has the same small limited uh, uh, number of molecular machines and nature is very lazy. It doesn't uh, uh, develop uh, a, uh, a new machine without very uh, big necessity. Uh, only limited uh, number of machines uh, nature combined in different cells with in different composition and obtained uh, different uh, physiological effect. What does it mean? It means that there could be a magic bullet 
uh, a drug that will reach just one target. Any uh, medicine will also have uh, side effects because uh, if it uh, target, uh, let's say, uh, some machine in the near, uh, nervous uh, cell, it will also target any other cells. And uh, we try to make a, a program which will uh, preliminary um, evaluate uh, potential drugs uh, to, to choose uh, candidates for uh, future uh, uh, drugs. It's very expensive and long way. If we can uh, do it uh, with artificial intelligence uh, uh, a little bit uh, easier, it will be a great uh, bonus for pharmaceutical uh, investigation uh, research. Uh, after that, I uh, uh, had to uh, make a pause in my scientific career. I had to work at, uh, as a manager of veterinary cleaning, but I feel that uh, my uh, scientific part of brain uh, is not satisfied. That is why I started uh, wet weetles pro uh, project. What is wet weetles? Wet weetles use uh, herbal medicine for the benefits of uh, for health benefits of animals. Okay. Uh, how did you, uh, what did you get from your parents? From my parents, I got uh, love for animals and interest in, uh, interest in uh, uh, way how the organism works. My mother was a doctor and my father uh, many years uh, uh, direct uh, circus and uh, those days uh, circus was mostly uh, animal business. There was a lot of exotic animals and I have access to touch them, to talk with uh, their trainer. Uh, it uh, put a lot of uh, influence on me. Also, my father was a great entrepreneur. That is why I think uh, some of his skills uh, was transferred on me and I start some entrepreneurial activity uh, like uh, veterinary clinic and then wet littles project. Uh, what do you gain from your mentor? I gain a lot from my mentor. I would say I try to follow his advices till now. But the main things that I got from him is uh, the uh, feeling that honest approach to research is the only way to, uh, is to uh, for success. The second thing I got from him is uh, understanding of difference uh, of uh, way of thinking of different prof in different profession. For instance, a mathematician work with numbers, and he has no doubt what he will get when he will uh, summarize uh, or uh, divide uh, numbers by numbers. Phys uh, physicians. Uh, physical uh, profession uh, work with the numbers but it's also understand that each measure has uh, deviation and uh, 
he need to know how accurate was this number uh, obtained. Medical way of thinking is uh, absolutely different. Uh, they have uh, very little freedom to uh, make a hypothesis, to uh, think beside instruction, because they risk with the life of their patient. On the other side, biological way of thinking is uh, very flexible, but uh, to make a right conclusion, you have to understand how uh, the findings of others were obtained. It's uh, very important to understand methodology that's behind any biological findings because uh, at different methods you can get different uh, conclusions. Uh, how scientific for neuroscience and life went together in your life? Uh, it was several times in my life when entrepreneurial skills and scientific uh, curiosity uh, worked together. Um, the most recent example is uh, wet ripples. Uh, for a while, when it's, uh, the perestroika just started in Russia, I organized uh, the first uh, private uh, scientific uh, institution there and we, uh, to get uh, some income, uh, start to uh, cultivate uh, herbal uh, medicine. We, beside selling them we also have to make some investigation and after a while i came to a conclusion that we have we can do something very helpful uh, for pets it uh, connected veterinary practice with uh, a scientific uh, approach with uh, uh, entrepreneurial uh, necessity. Uh, you are founder of Red Peoples. Why? Uh, as I said, uh, it's a connection of scientific approach and uh, uh, business uh, activity. Uh, I, uh, during many years I developed uh, uh, complex formulas of uh, herbs for different uh, health condition of uh, animals and uh, after additional experimentation we propose uh, like nine most uh, popular formulas uh, and this formula is uh, based on uh, herbal composition, not one herb, but uh, several ones. Uh, you know, there is always a dispute uh, between official medicine and herbal traditional folk medicine. You, you know, there is many terms for this uh, way of health treatment. Uh, usually, uh, the prehistory of most uh, drugs uh, are herbs, aspirin, uh, other things, uh, was first uh, coffee, we eat uh, uh, coffee, uh, tablets with caffeine and uh, other stimulant uh, like eight uh, tons uh, 
be, a year for whole mankind, but uh, we consume coffee and tea which contain the same uh, pharmaceutical agents uh, in uh, a thousand times more. And uh, there is a lot of other examples when uh, official medicine use uh, findings from herbal medicine. Recently they found that uh, uh, aurica uh, mushroom in uh, South uh, America stimulate the growth of neurons. It was published just a couple of days ago by a uh, respectful uh, laboratory and uh, it's the way to find a uh, cure for Alzheimer. Uh, there is no need to say how dangerous this disease and there is no other way to prevent or to fight disease. So I try to uh, use my understanding of uh, side effects, uh, of cause of side effects and uh, uh, benefits of herbal medicine uh, to produce the best uh, supplements for uh, pets. Uh, they address the most common health issue in uh, dogs and cats and that is uh, why I do it. Uh, what's the distinction for the vet vetoes approach to herbal uh, options uh, to improve uh, the health of, uh, of uh, uh, the cats? Uh, I would say that uh, last decades uh, the popularity of natural uh, health uh, aids become very popular. Uh, it's become uh, very attractive for most people. But uh, other companies uh, based their supplements on one or two herbs only. Okay, they found that this herb uh, is helpful under this condition or other conditions. But, as I said, there is no way to find a magic bullet uh, and one herb cannot be mm, as effective as mixture of them. So I developed formula cons which cons formulas which consist of several, sometimes it's uh, 10 or even more herbs which uh, imitate, uh, which uh, stimulate the positive effects of this formula and uh, uh, mimic uh, and compensate negative effects. That is uh, the main difference. And uh, also our uh, products can, uh, contain no uh, chemicals at all. Uh, many companies declare uh, that their supplements are natural, but they uh, make it with uh, glycerin, uh, polyethylene glycol, uh, even uh, uh, any uh, medicine tablets, uh, it's not only uh, the main agent, but also uh, they put there something for taste, for uh, composition, uh, and it's chemicals. We uh, produce our herbal formulas uh, on uh, 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 coconut uh, butter, which is natural, helpful, uh, healthy, and uh, there is no any chemicals at all. Okay.
I hope that my years in this interview will be perfect. Конечно, 